Good evening, everyone. Al Bernstein here along with me are my partners, Max Kellerman and Teddy Atlas. We're glad you could join us for what should be an exciting heavyweight matchup. Okay, boxing fans, let's turn our attention to ringside as the two fighters make their way into the ring. Teddy Atlas, tell us what you think of this fight. Willie Patterson's greatest assets is that hand speed, and he has power with it. Teddy Atlas, any comments on this fighter? People say Smoke and Joe Frazier is one-dimensional. But when that one dimension is so great, like that left hook, hey, you can get away with it. Now let's take a quick look at the judges for tonight's fight. It's just about fight time, so let's turn it over to Jimmy Lennon Jr. for tonight's introduction. All right, fight fans, here we go. We welcome you to Madison Square Garden in New York, New York. It's time for our main event of the evening. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime. And presenting first, fighting out of the blue corner, Floyd Patterson. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, introducing Smokin' Joe Frazier. And the referee for tonight's bout is Mills Lane. Gentlemen, we've gone through all the instructions in the dressing room. I expect a good, clean fight. Protect yourself at all times. Are there any questions? All right, let's get it on. Any thoughts for the fans watching this one at home on television? <laughs> well, Al, I predict a close fight tonight. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised to see this one go all the way. He's not going to land a hook from that. Frazier defending his head. by putting money in the bank. Gain interest. <laughs> what an exchange of punches. Frazier guards his head. Well, Max, it's time for some EA Sports Fight Trivia. What interesting tidbit do you have for us tonight? Thanks, Al. 
Did you know that George Foreman holds the record for being the oldest boxing champion in the history of the sport? He was an amazing 45 years, 10 months old when he became heavyweight champion in 1994. Interesting stuff, Max. Thanks a lot. highlights from the last round. Here we go. It's time for round three of this scheduled 12 round. attention to the referee if it hadn't been blocked. <laughs> Deflecting that ferocious cross. up on the jab by Patterson. Nice, quick reaction there. 
Nice punch there by Patterson. Perfect fundamental there. Good job of keeping his gloves up. Teddy, how did you score for the first four rounds? Thank you, Al. I have a score 40, 36. Four rounds to nothing, Pat. Got his arms in the way of that punch. Nice two jab combination there. Good job covering up there. Thundering combination upstairs. Nice shot by Patterson. Couldn't get much cleaner than that, Al. Excellent combination for the head and the body. Al, that was a great combination. Crisp, clean, and a good mix of punches. Going with a great jab. Protecting against that powerful hook. Body punches telegraph, and the moment he starts to throw it, it gives that a chance. Protecting against that huge uppercut. Here we go, round number six. Round six is in the book. Let's take another look at some of the action from the last round. So we move into round seven. This one is scheduled to go 12.
definitely has the momentum on his side right now. But he has to start thinking about taking care of that jab with a counter. The left slipping off. Not exactly sure how that missed. Solid right by Patterson. A thundering combination upstairs by Patterson. Wow, that combination upstairs had to hurt. Nice punch there by Patterson. Final seconds of round seven. Nice punch there by Patterson. Perfectly set up there. What a stupendous round. Teddy, how do you have it scored so far? Ah, oh, this isn't much of a contest. You have it scored 70 through 63. Seven rounds to nothing. Had it. Oh, he just got to defend against the right. Booming shot by Frazier. That was a, a nice hard punch up top. This has just turned into an all-out brawl. Number
We head into the 10th round. This one is scheduled for 12. Trading shots in the middle of the ring. Look at this back and forth action. <coughs> against that charging run. That's impressive that he's fast enough to avoid jab but Allie's a bit too far to land that jab. Solid shot there by Patterson. That blue right there, Al. Timing is what counts, not just power. Love you the about the to me like only one fighter showed up to fight tonight. I haven't scored 192. 10 rounds to two. Patterson. Good job of losing the jab. Ferocious combination down low. Al, those body shots were perfectly timed. Away. That right was about as close as you can get and still miss. Protecting against that overhand. Smart block. Defending the head. It's a blistering combination up there by Patterson. Frazier guards his head. <clears throat> Punishing combination to the head by Frazier. Frazier, defending his head. Excellent defense. Excellent timing with that combination. <clears throat> Patterson, not really controlling this fight here like he has been all night. Good flurry downstairs. Brutal combination upstairs. Combinations like those are really going to open up chances for a knockout. <clears throat> Locking upstairs. Just looking at you. Powerful combination for both the head and the body by Patterson. Round 11 comes to a close. <laughs> Round. Solid punch there. That left should have connected. Frazier keeps his arms down with the check against that body punch. for 
furious punches to both the head and the body. Patterson blocking up top. combination downstairs by Frazier. Well, how about the time he started to move, that punch is already connected. Hey, most of the body is like putting money in the bank. He gained interest as the fight goes on. He lined him up for that one. So we reached the end of the 12th round. All right, let's hear the announcement of tonight's decision in the ring with Jimmy Lennon Jr. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner by unanimous decision, Lloyd Patterson. Teddy, your reaction to the judge's decision? Well, oh, I don't care who the judges are, but three flying mites to get this one right. Mm -hmm. There's mm -hmm. only one way here. Mm -hmm. so, 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 so. That's all we have for you tonight from New York City. For Max Kellerman and Teddy Atlas, this is Al Bernstein saying goodbye.